good morning students welcome to the class this is your web development lab class okay or wt lab class in the previous class we completed introduction to html and some um, basic elements or how to create a simple web page all these things we will complete it so today i will teach you some basic html tag okay so let us detail in detail how the tags are html tags html tags are elements name element names surrounded by angle brackets that means less than and greater than angles are uh, greater than symbols are used in a tag name okay so the syntax is tag name then the contents then uh, and the tag name is closed with forward slash okay html tags normally come in pairs like opening tag and a closing tag the first tag in a pair tag is the start tag and second tag is the end tag or start tag is also known as opening tag and tag is also known as closing tag okay the end tag is written like the start tag but with a forward slash inserted before the tag name okay so let us discuss about the different tags which are used in our html code okay html html tag this one is your opening tag this one is your closing tag or start tag or end tag okay here html tag is the root elements of the html document okay the html document document itself begin begins with html and ends with a slash html okay after that we write head tag this tag represents the document's header which can keep other html tags <coughs> like title link etc okay this one is also a pair tag the tag which have one starting tag or start tag and one end tag these tags are known as pair tag and the tag which have no ending tag this is known as singular tag okay or empty tag also known as a empty tag next one is our title tag title tag is always used inside the head tag okay and this one is also a pair tag after that we close the head then we start the body html part documents or html code can be divided in two parts one is header part and another one is body part in the header section we include html links tag all these things after that we close the header tag then we open the body tag okay in the body tag the visible part of the html document is between the body part okay next we discuss about the html headings html headings are defined with h1 to h6 okay h1 is the largest heading largest size heading and h6 is the smallest don't confuse h1 one means this one is small and six means this one is bigger no here h1 means is this one is the bigger size h6 means this one is the smaller size and html heading tag is used for heading okay so this one is your example this one h1 tag is also a pair tag which we want open the h1 then after the contents right then we close that h1 okay so here one lava or one example also we will mention here first we open the html then head tag then title this one is our web page 2 okay then title close 
then head tackler then we open the body part in the body part here we write all the heading tags or the size smallest to biggest okay the here the h1 will come to sk devi in this way all these things we are right after that we uh, here we open the center tag center tag is used for the centering the text in the page okay in the web page then center tag close body close html close the uh, when we run this code the output is look like this also i will show you to run this code We write the code HTML head title web page head close body open then center tag open then h1 tag open welcome to sktv h1 close okay all these things are here we write one thing angular bracket br br tag is used for the line break that means if we don't write the br tag then all these things in a single line okay if you write br tag then this one is here next show you in the next line so i will show you one thing okay how this look like this file set then open adding the text to me okay i will show you how it will be done this will be look like this okay in this way here the br tag is your line break after we run this program it will show you look like this okay the br tag is line spacing enter a next enter a new line so in this way it look like this okay let's come to the one next tab now we discuss about the html paragraph tag HTML paragraphs are defined with a P tag. That means when we insert a paragraph or when we write a paragraph, first we start the P tag. Okay. After that, we write the paragraph. We close this paragraph tag using forward slash. Okay. Here, for one example, is there P tag is op open? Then this is a paragraph. Then P tag is close. Here we we write only small sentence. Only. Uh, but you also write one paragraph and then close if we don't close the paragraph tag and then open the another paragraph it will mix and one paragraph is there now display the two paragraphs okay browser automatically add some white space or margin before or after a paragraph but here browser automatically add some white space or in a margin before or after a paragraph okay next uh, tag is our hr tag which one is horizontal rules if we write draw a horizontal line then we use the hr tag hr tag defines a thematic break in a html page and is most often displayed as a horizontal rule the hr element is used to separate content in an html page okay the horizontal tag is a empty tag this the horizontal tag no need to closing this okay and another one is line breaks to uh, to break the line we use the br tag the html br element defines a line break use br if you want a line break or a new line without starting a new paragraph okay that means here this is a this is 
then we here we use the here that means after this is a paragraph is mentioned in the new line okay anywhere we write the beer then e till enters a new line no need to hit it so here you use one example of the paragraph tag write html to code to write program in html to display the text in a paragraph form so this paragraph this text is open in a paragraph form here also same thing html will be opening opening tag now root element which one is open then head tag open then title then title close then head head close then body open then we write the paragraph using p tag we first open the p tag then write the paragraph or text then close the p tag here we use two b r that means two line breaks as here and we use a one hr which one is our horizontal line display okay then two line breaks are there then another paragraph tag also mentioned here okay so in this way the output is look like this also we have run this code and show you okay in this way we write the code HTML head title head close body paragraph also there. After that, you save this file, save as, and file name give there with the extension and save as type always set as uh, all files. Okay, then click on save. Here we already save this. Save this section. Okay, when we run this code. it will look like this okay h r tag we will use this here the this one is the horizontal ruler this one is partition this okay next we discuss about the html pre element html pre element defines pre formatted text the text inside a pre element is displayed in a fixed width font and it features both spaces and line breaks that means in the html document whatever we write in which in whatever manner the display look like that in the browser okay and another thing is the html comments Pre tag is also a uh, pair tag, which one is opening tag and another one is uh, closing tag. Okay. Then HTML comment. Comment tags are used to insert comment in the HTML source code. You can add comment to your HTML source by using following syntax. To write the comments, that means the line which you, you want to comment, that means first we start the or open the angular bracket then exclamatory sign then hyphen only two hyphens are there okay then you write the text then you when we close it two hyphens then greater than symbol is there okay in this way you write the code you write the comment okay Notice that there is an exclamation point in the opening tag but not in the closing tag. Exclamation sign point sign is in your opening tag. Okay, not in the closing tag. Opening tag is simple, less than symbol, exclamation sign and two hyphens. Only two hyphens, not three, four. Okay. And comments are not displayed by browser, browser but they can help document your HTML source code. So in this way, you write the comment. This is a comment, but this line is not so here. But here, this write a paragraph. This is a paragraph. It will show this. And remember to add more information here. This will also not 
Tony in the browser or in the output screen. Okay. Comments are also great for debugging HTML because you can comment out HTML line of code one at a time to search for errors. Okay. Next one is our centering the contents or centering the text. Center tag is used to put any content in the center of the page or any table cell. Okay. Which one is so, so we have discussed in the first level. Then here this is a paragraph. This is not in the center, but when you open the center tag and then write some the text and close the center tag, that portion will be uh, display in a center. Okay. Here also one example for pre tag, pre tag, center tag, and comments. All these things are in this level. Here we open the HTML tag, then head tag open, then title open, then we write a title name which one is web page 4, then close the title with forward slash, then close the head with using forward slash, then we open the body tag, then we open the center tag, then in the center tag we write here rhymes, then center tag closed, ok. After that we here we may open the pre tag. And also here we mention a comments line. This is a rhymes for kids. It will not show you in your browser or in your output screen. Okay. Here one rhymes are there. In which manner the rhymes is written here. In this manner only show you in your web page. Okay. If we don't write in this manner. If we don't write the is in the in between the pre tag then it will not look like in this way ok I will show you in a in your lover then we open the close tag then we close the body tag then you close the html tag ok so this one is your output looks like this so I will show you this lover okay. hi okay here we write HTML opening tag is your uh, opening root element is your HTML then head open then title open we mention here the title name then title close head also close then body open here we write the rhymes which is display in your center in the page center okay then we write the pre tag if we mm, and this is a rhymes uh, for kids this one is your comment this will also not show you in there in which manner we write it will display in that way okay i will run you and show you okay in which in this manner we will write this and will show you now if we don't write in the pre using in the in between the pre tag then how it will show you Now see the difference. File set. Okay. It will show you like this because here no line breaks are there and no need to pre no pre tags are there. So it will show you in a line only. Okay. This is the effect. If we use the br tag here, if we use the br tag, angular bracket br, okay.
if we mention the beer tag here then it will show you in the next line okay how it will show you also will show you. look like we will show you okay in this way we use the beer tag so it will show you in this way but here we don't use the pre tag so it will use in a left side okay in, in the by default wrapped alignment but in the next line in the previous previously here we will no here we will not use the um, we not use the beer tag so it will show you in a one line okay so this is the example of a pre tag So that's all in this class. In the previous class, I will discuss another tag. Sorry, in the next class, we will discuss another tags are there. Okay. So thank you.